No, I don't. I don't mind. Hey, I get asked that question. I, I get asked that I question. Ask. I get asked that question every day of my life. Sometimes twice. And uh, today you're the first one. <laughs> <laughs> but, the, but the day's not over yet. You might be. <laughs> um, um, it was right after that play happened, I, I knew something was wrong. Something was going to happen because, like I said earlier, you know, you know the Marlins kept coming back. And, you know, and uh, we needed to get every single out that we could get. And I remember it was Luis Castillo. He hit the foul ball. And I knew I had that ball because I was, I was bad doing that play, either, either robbing a homer or going to the side and jumping because I, I always took my eyes off. I never went like this. For some reason, I guess I was trying always to jump high and my, I put my head down all the time. I, I, I made some. But they were like lucky catch, but most of the time I never made it. But this one, I saw everything. I mean, I, was, I did it perfectly, I timed it perfectly, and I jumped, and I had it on the sun. I see arms all over the place, and that place, that place happened. And uh, I was upset. I threw, everybody know, every, everybody seen it. I threw, my, I threw my glove. I was upset. I, I said a couple of bad words in Spanish, and... And, and then I kind of put myself together, and and they score eight after that after that play. They score eight runs. I mean, nobody talks about the ground ball that could should have been double play, and we wouldn't we wouldn't be talking about this play right now. Uh, but they took advantage of it, and it cost us our trip to the World Series. I remember after the game, you know, we lost the game. We were talking about, I remember, we were like in the bathroom, you know, our clubhouse in Chicago, they were tiny. I don't know if they made it, made, made them be, uh, bigger now. But remember like Sammy, uh, Aramis, and another guy, and me with like by the bathroom talking about it. And I said, you know what? Hey, uh, it wasn't his fault, you know? I mean, everybody, how many people you go, you go to the ballpark and see they bring a glove? Everybody wants to catch a fly ball. You don't think about the score. I mean, 90% of the people that go to the to the ballpark, they don't even pay, <laughs> they even pay attention to the score, especially they're women. They're talking about something else. But uh, the, the guy wanted to catch up. I mean, he didn't know it was going to interfere in the play. And I said that to the media, too. But uh, the funny thing about that, that I still get hate, hate uh, Twitter comments. Uh, Blaming me that I made that guy's life miserable. Uh, I get that question asked every day in my life. Uh, what else? Uh, there's a lot of always fake story that I, there's a story that I told some kid at an elevator that I, I didn't have a chance to catch the ball. I did have a chance. I had the ball. I mean, I'm 100%. I'm going to die with that in my heart. I, I had the ball. And uh, so there's a lot of things about that play. And you know, uh, I'm hoping, you know, the, uh, finally the Cubs win. They're not going to be talking about the play anymore. And they still talk about the same time, the same amount of time. I guess